Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. I don't know if you guys can see, there's a bit of an orange tinge to the sky. It smells like a campfire. It's it's essentially just like living at, a, at, a, at your camp. Like it just feels like there's a campfire happening, but the sky is still murky and gross. Actually, I feel like the air quality today is a little bit worse than it was. Yeah, it is worse. People who live in the evacuation areas are advised not to ride their horse, not to exercise their horse, and they have a bunch of stuff that they have to follow because um, riding in bad air quality conditions can be really de detrimental to your horse, obviously. We're a little bit further, but and our conditions aren't as bad, but I still don't think it's safe to be riding our horse, unfortunately. So we're gonna just hang in until things improve. There, if you guys don't know, if you didn't see yesterday's video, there are wildfires far from us, but all the smoke is coming this way. It's just super cloudy. Never in my entire lifetime have I ever had like a forest fire near me. And like I said, it's not near us. Hopefully it doesn't come near us. Sadly, I've not seen our cat around recently, but I see a lot of mouse poop. Our food is going, but I see a lot of mouse poop and I saw a mouse yesterday, so I'm not sure if it's the mice eating it or if he's coming back, but we haven't seen him, have we? It is freezing, it's the crack of dawn. We're just feeding our horses now. Our farrier is foot day on the day by day farm. I'm really excited. I love foot day. All the girls are having breakfast. Uh, we're her first people to come. Like we're her first stop every single time she comes because we live close to her. Like, we're always here. So we can just take any appointment that she has. So it is the crack it on and we're up. Gabby is still waking up. Gabby is still getting up. Gabby is, Gabby is Gabby. It's honestly so eerie to see outside. Hopefully it gets better today. Yesterday, this breeze cleared the air a lot. Only in the morning was it muggy like this. Like only in the morning did it smell like smoke. I tried to clean Storm's stall for Sophie and she got mad. She likes to clean her own horse's stall. Days like this make me realize how lucky we are that we live in Canada and we hardly have any natural disasters. I mean, we did have a tornado last year. Uh, that's rare though. Everything's changing, but I'm so grateful that I grew up in a time where it was, it was so safe. Hey. All right, Farrier is come done on. for two weeks. Hey, Gus, come <laughs> She's on. coming back to do Storm. Gus is coming. Because, <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Come on, come on, buddy. <laughs> they just run so far now. Gus, come on. Come on. <laughs> he doesn't know who to go to. Anyways, um, so Storm came home like in the middle of a, barrier rotation so he's only had his oh, shoes on for a short amount of time <laughs> it's so funny come on Gus. they run so fast so she's gonna come so she's she's gonna bridge the gap of time so storm will get his feet down again in two more weeks and then the next rotation he'll be on our rotation uh, so she comes back in two more weeks and she'll do storm she said Chino's doing a little better <sighs> I'm tired. Hi, Ellie Bear. Wait, let me sit. Help. I'm getting sick. Are you going to put them in the water or no? Uh, the water's freezing. So someone was saying in the comments that <laughs> baby ducks that are hatched should not, or baby Jesus geese, Christ. watch those chickens, Sophia those geese. Out a piece of my hair and it um, that, that they shouldn't <laughs> swim, but I did a lot of, I did a lot of research. <laughs> We've had baby geese before no. and baby yeah. ducks before. And what I've always found is that they absolutely should still swim, but it should be for a limited amount of time. And that they should be allowed to preen dry, so like they can dry themselves. I'm just gonna stand on it. Okay. <laughs> They're so cute. Um, brownie slash platypus slash Perry the platypus. The brown one absolutely is, is attached to the other. <sighs> All I smell is smoke. It is literally so cold. I love our farrier though. I love when she comes and I love her. Like she just explains things to me so well and she's just a miracle worker. Like I just absolutely love her. In fact, I love our whole team. Our chiropractor comes this week too. <laughs> We're having the whole team. Horses just got out for breakfast late. We gave them a little bit of hay in the field while they were doing their car, while they were getting their feet done. So they just got out for breakfast now. 
So Sylvia and I are in Walmart. Have you guys seen water, water TikTok? Water talk it's called. Anyway, it's all about like making sugar-free drinks. Is that strawberry lemonade? Mango pineapple. Anyway, in Canada, you can't really get a lot of that stuff, but I always drink this stuff. But I've never tried any of this stuff before. I can already tell I'm gonna love the mango pineapple. Anyway, these are the kinds that we have here. I saw some really fun flavors on Amazon. But it's this one. Aren't the same thing. I know, well, it is the same stuff. No, these, the ones that have the little tiny packets, are the right ones. Well, you can do it with these too. I bad. This one's iced tea, and I hate iced tea. So these are the flavors. We're getting lemon lime, lemon and strawberry, mango pineapple, and fruit punch. I can't ride our horses because of the air quality. And actually, it's clear now. It's totally clear. Wow, look at the difference. Clear enough for the sun to come out. It's clear. It's clear enough for the sun. We could probably ride our horses. So I think what happens is that the wind changes, and then the air gets clear, and then it changes back again. Last night, the air was really clear. And then this, in the middle of the night, I woke up because I could smell smoke again. And I looked out the window, and you could see an orange haze over the sky. So I woke up. My room was orange. Your, yeah, your room was orange when you woke up. Just the windows. Yeah. It's the brightest room in the morning. When yeah. It's so anyway, I don't know if that means like you can ride when it's not hazy, or we're just gonna wait until they clear the warning. We're under like a, a warning, Hi. air quality warning. Good, Anyway, we're headed home now. We just went to do some shopping and we're headed home. And I get really excited whenever we're gonna go home because I know our pets are waiting. Like Ellie, it makes me so happy. Like Mr. Gus, and the duck Mr. and the Bradley. goose make me so happy. I get so excited to see them. And also, I like just hanging out in the barn. So I like just hanging out there with them. All right, so we are home. And I'm gonna try pineapple really mango. I never buy these little packets. The little packets are better. You think so? Because they have to dissolve though. These are the ones that I buy. Favorite lunch of all time for years and years and years is cottage cheese and cherries. It's my favorite, absolute favorite lunch ever. It's literally been the worst day. It has been the worst day, you guys. I've just been cleaning my house. It's cold, the air quality sucked. It's been overcast. And now it's raining. The horses are going out for dinner. And it's raining. I left my phone up in the house and Elizabeth is gonna call me. Oh no, I'm screwed. Can I have your phone? I don't have it. Uh oh. Why are you licking your leg? That looks suspicious. I've you better not have a, a cut. I've never seen a horse lick his leg before. Here, let me in. I've never seen that before either. That's, that's suspicious. Oh, what? Why do you say, oh God? I need a sponsor. Oh no. <laughs> well, you know what Storm does when he has a pet. What the freak? What the freak? Oh, all right, it's just a little cut. Oh, wait a minute. I can't see. All right, it's his chestnut. <laughs> I'm like terrified. Literally, I'm not even joking, you guys. Like, if, when it rains, it pours. <laughs> and it's raining. So Penny's in heat and Storm's an idiot. And I don't mean that in the literal sense. But I could tell right away that there was a cut on him because he was licking it. He's. <laughs> He's a dog. Gabby, your, do your horse is injured. Ugh. No, I don't know what happened, but he cut himself. I walked in and he was licking his leg. Look down at the bottom. Is there anything on the bottom? Once he gets in here in the light, I'll look. So you went and grabbed my horse for what reason? Because he's injured. I walked in and he was licking his leg. I'm like, oh no, don't even tell me. So we gotta, gotta get our handy dandy first aid kit. <laughs> Oh man, I'm a worrier and a freaker outer. There's actually germs in saliva. Yes, I know that. Right, so you gotta clean it. Anyway, we're gonna clean Storm's leg, take a better look at it. Is he lame? No, I don't think so. Yeah. Oh, don't it's just. Me. She takes one medical course and she thinks I'm <laughs> What the fuck? I love that. I don't need gloves. <laughs> He was, um, he was looking a different spot on his leg because the blood dripped down. Yeah, him. that's what I thought. All right, let's take a look at that sucker. We are not wrapping his leg. Don't they just have All right, it's literally the tiniest cut. Don't they just have band-aids? I don't just... know how he did it, but my guess is that it's... Probably crazy. But look where it is. That's where you have to really be careful of. Oh, here we go. That it's not like we on a joint. Alcohol wipes. 
Uh, I would do that because it's alcohol free cleansing wipes. If yes. Alcohol, alcohol free all the way. Alcohol free. Anyway, alcohol. he cleaned all the blood. He <laughs> licked himself clean. There's blood in his dolphin. So. <laughs> so you guys, I mean, at least you chose the time when we can't ride. Yeah. So at least you. Well, it's that. probably gonna be clear tomorrow because all this rain. You should have done that like two days earlier. Yeah, like, why couldn't you do this? Do this two days ago. Um, my guess is that somebody small kicked him. That was probably Honey then. No, it was it that's was Gracie. Honey's height. Yeah, but it was Gracie for sure. If they're that tall, then they oh. kick lower. Oh look, he. Oh, he even has blood on his nose. It's okay, handsome. We know. He has, like, got a cut. In his nostril. So, fun fact. No, that's just what their nostrils no, look right like. There. No, that's just what their nostrils look like. <laughs> look at his nostrils. You know how they have, like, expert. And oh, then wait a minute. <laughs> yeah. So, this just goes on it. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah. Storm, you've been having some trouble. It does not smell like alcohol. Oh, no, his nose is bleeding. Sting that bad. Or he got blood from. Right, move. From his leg on his nose. I think there's a little cut in there. Stop it. So I just wipe it off? I don't know. He's got like. Okay, question. Do I use this? Yes. Go ahead. Okay. Well, she already opened it, so obviously. All right. You know, Storm should be a pro. You should have washed oh, your hands, too. I should have. You want to put gloves on? Yeah. We have gloves because she brought out the whole freaking medical <laughs> kit. They're like, she took one first aid kit. Open the other thing. I'll use this to wash off my hands. So, a fun fact about. You need scissors, by the way. Fun fact about yeah. Finn is that the only time he actually was lame Storm? in the three years that we owned him, Storm? no, Finn. Finn, was one time when he got kicked by Gracie or got kicked by Willow. Willow kicked him uh, over some joint or something. He was lame for two weeks, just mildly lame, but he was sore for two that. weeks. It was the only time it's he was lame. because he runs away from danger. Yeah, he was a runner way -er. Storm's a fighter, but you know what? Storm needs to be away from the... Yeah, Storm, next time run. Like, in our next house, Bloody. there will be two paddocks. One for girls and one for boys. Mark my word, guys. Because having him in a pasture with girls just is the most annoying thing. Having him in a pasture with anybody. He's just <laughs> the most annoying thing. It's just like, I'm going to clean this blood. Okay, you guys, keep in mind that we... We always joke around when things get like nerve wracking because I it's the know. only way for us to keep our our you wits about us and cut. to not get stressed out. It like, was just he was sitting there. How do you tell when they when it's too deep? It didn't look deep to me. Look for blood on their feet. <laughs> that when... Sophie thinks that that's how we should find out who kicked them. Sophia, what? Okay, so Gabby, get get dressed in it there. You're frustrating. How do I wrap it? I got blood on my hands. So, like, um, put, so get a gauze pad, a clean one. That's a pad pad. Yeah, that's a Get a, a wound compress pad, but get the one. It's ones... not that big. Yeah. <laughs> well, you can cut these into yeah, little can. sizes. You just use cotton swabs? Yeah, I just oh, don't so know how. this? Uh, I don't know how. Yeah, you can wrap it in that and then I'll get vet wrap. I don't know. I took one first aid kit and I still don't know what I'm doing. Hers is so different than people. They have like weird bodies that, that like you can't put them in bed and say, hey, lay here and be good. What color you want? What color vet wrap? wrap? We got dark blue, light blue, purple, or pink? Wait, I want you to pink. Give me a girly color. Give me a girly color. That one well, girly color. Do you think that would be enough? Yeah. Take both just in case. Girly color. Girly color. So some kind of... You should know how to wrap Yeah, you've feet, wrapped, you know, a lot. So and these hooves, hooves are different. I'm counting on it unrolling so that I can roll up. And then we're gonna check out his nose because I think he got his nose hurt too. Well, they were squealing when I was sitting on the sling. So I literally was watching the camera tonight. All the other horses are like, we could be out there eating already, Storm, but you did this. Oh, basically the problem is, is that Storm needs a friend. He doesn't have anybody that likes him. The girls hate him. Penny's in heat, so he Penny's the likes only one her, that care. and she does not like him. All the horses run from him. Penny, like, screams and fights him, like, kicks him, every, like, anytime he comes near her. Gracie kicks him anytime he comes near her, or her baby. She has vet wrap. I think so, actually. Yeah. How do I wrap this? Just wrap it. If you right pull out. it, it stretches. Yeah, it's supposed to sew. So that it doesn't get too tight. Don't do it too tight. Make sure you can get fingers in there. She is a pro. Anyway, we're just going to do our best. The reason that we're going to put something on it 
is Two. is because I've never seen a horse lick his leg though. I know I've never seen that before either. He was licking his leg like a dog does when they have a cut, and I'm like, why are you licking your leg? Is there tape in here? Yeah, is there's vet wrap? Oh, we're using vet wrap. Yeah. yeah. See, it's okay. we're going. So, anyways, he needs somebody that's his friend. He likes to play. He's a boy, and the girls don't understand him. They all hate him. It's been like a month. He's been home a month. Honey doesn't care about him. Honey, it does not like him. She's scared of him. It's the only thing that she's scared of. So uh, the only reason I'm dressing it is because it's like a little bit deep. It's not like dangerous deep, but anytime bacteria gets into a cut like that, you guys know what happened to Chino when he got a, he got a hawk sore one time at an old barn and we showed up in the morning and he was swollen and stiff and had an infection. And, and that hawk sore wasn't even bleeding. No, it was barely a pinhole. Like it was barely anything and it was old and he still got an infection in it. So I think it looks too tight. It's good. I don't, so it's not over his knee joint, so it should stay on. Do you want tape? That I can fit my fingers in it. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, all right. Like you could probably slide it down here. All right, let's take a look. I don't know. Oh yeah, that's okay. perfect. But that's like in the little dent. Yeah. Okay, leave it alone before it comes off. Yeah. My skills all right. are not good. Stop. No, your skills are great, Gabby. See, that's how she learns. She takes care of her. We all take care of our own horses. See, it's sliding down already. Okay, let's get horses from home. All right. Well, you know what? All we can do is what we can do. I mean, if the worst thing that happens is we keep some antibiotic cream in it. <laughs> He's like, let's go outside. All right, don't go near Mr. Yeah, Pink leave Boy. Storm alone. He's been in too much pain. She's like, I'm in heat, though. She walks by him with her tail raised up. What's on Gracie's butt? Storm, behave. Gracie. Well. It's deep. It's like she got kicked. No, that's a bite for sure. It's he, like deep, but it's like. It's not I, deep, but we'll clean her too. I'm All right. Do that as he's walking out. Come on. Come on. I'll let him go himself. Oh, Willow's, bad. Willow's like, what's happening? I don't understand. Well, I don't know how this thing got out. Well, people told me before we got horses that horses are really hard and horses are a lot. And I was like, yeah, of course. We literally have taken care of every animal you could ever imagine. We've had so many different kind of animals, so many wild baby animals, like so many animals. And I thought like truly how hard can they be? They are freaking hard, you guys. Don't you know that you're beautiful?